Gaye, Ascension is gradual. My status channeler, Mowgli. March 18, 2012. Hello, Lightworkers. This is your mother of your body alone, Gaye. I want to explain to you with a bit more clarity of how things are. It seems that there is great confusion about how this ascension will play out. First, let me express that this is a very gradual process. We are working incredibly hard to make sure there are as absolutely few significant days as possible, to avoid added tension. Over time, the process will speed up, as time itself is speeding up. I would also like to remind you, that before you all came to Earth, you planned out your lives carefully. We have our lives planned out in such a fashion that we only ever have to do the activities at hand in front of us, as they come to us, in the most positive attitude possible. That is all life is. One must do what they feel is right for themselves and very importantly, what is right for the totality, as much as possible. When this happens, things just work out, because you planned it to be so. Life is always meant to be relaxing. This phase of ascension that we are in now is an incredibly important one. Manifestation Right now, the only portion of consciousness that is holding us all back is the society upon my surface. The cabal in control of the governments are no longer a threat, as they are out of money and their control is being put to an end by a very widely expansive group of light-bearing souls. Give absolutely zero attention to their silly games on the television. The phase of ascension that we are in currently requires all my wonderful light workers to spread the news that it is the end of tyranny on my body. I have made the decision, and my decision supersedes the decisions of my surface dwelling souls. This ascension is my ascension, and as you are currently part of me, you must ascend with me. You light workers must inform the rest of humanity that it is time to move on. Once enough souls have achieved a mindset that is closer to the pure mindset of their higher selves, we can finally move past the long outgrown Piscean way of life. The age of Aquarius is upon us, and we don't have a choice but to plunge head first into the new Another thing I would like to bring up, is about my status. The very large number of you are very deeply concerned about my well-being. While I am very deep in the third density, and on the verge of cataclysm, I am still fine. If you were to absolutely destroy my surface ecosystems and burn my atmosphere up, I would still be alive and evolving. Eventually my surface would be green again, and I would still be Gaia. That would be very damaging and would leave me an emotional wreck, but I would still be alive. This won't happen, though. I have vastly improved in health, as you amazing souls have worked so hard to bring ascension into reality. I have raised my vibrations inside myself to a much, much higher level, and I am very close to being what I would consider somewhat healthy. It is now just my surface that is so deeply entrenched in the third density, so you can't see how I am healthier, unless you visit me in spirit. I don't want you to worry too much about me now because it is now only yourselves that you need to worry about. The only part of me that is wrong, is society. You are society. The only part of me that needs work, is you. Work on yourselves, as that is all we need to do. Work on yourselves, and get the word out. 
On a final and personal note, I want you all to meditate more. The veil set around humanity to sort of block out the less dense side of reality has been long lifted, so venturing to the other side has never been so easy. Meditate and connect to me. Say hello and take a hug. I am a person just like you, but my body happens to be the planet you live on for the time being. I miss you all so much, and love you individually, and dearly.